What question are you asking? What is wrong with this picture? Now is there a different vehicle sitting in, our, sitting in this goddamn driveway? You know what it is? This vehicle's a rental. Yeah, I figured I'd take the vid. <laughs> Peter Carr goes back to the dealership just so they can look at, look, so they can check, look at, at the damage. I hate to say it ain't even fucking safe to drive. This is like a uh, Impala. It's like the LT model. And yeah, it is a V6. It is a fucking rental. Goddamn rental. <laughs> How the fuck did a uh, plastic fork come in here? This is interesting. I don't know what this is. Uh. <laughs> Probably makes good sense in case, uh, in case of baggage, then you have to unlock the vehicle. Over here, lock, unlock, lock, bullshit. Alarm. Trunk. Oh yeah, you that goddamn remote start shit. <laughs> it says 4G LTE. Goddamn 4G LTE shit. It's got electric, whatever, windows and shit like that. Thank you for this. Oh. Oh yeah, shit in the goddamn console, stability control switch, for a shifter, everything's all, every, all transmissions are just 6P these days. Let's see, it's like trunk release here. They put some, least, kind of rental agencies, at least put some god, I thought I couldn't enterprise put some goddamn floor mats, put some decent floor mats in a vehicle. Thank you, sir. And this uh, push bunch shit here. Push that motherfucker and uh. <laughs> oh, yeah, dual zone climate control. Apparently, can't even clean a vehicle or the shit. The push button, everything. Except the temperature control. Automatic synchronization. Must have the fucking navigation. <laughs> Vanity mirrors there. Fighting navigation system. Like this is stupid. But my only advantage it might have is playing a nice backup camera. See radio, media. I'm not even gonna show you that shit because who needs navigation systems in cars anyway? All that usual shit there speak. Got the goddamn on store. Light switches here. Off door on, what the fuck that means. Yeah, like say wiper controls on the passenger on the right side on the right side of the steering column and the light controls there. <laughs> I think the pat I think that was always that was always unique to fucking GM vehicles. Fucking hazards, we're not gonna use that vents, whatever. Goddamn oh, leather. Oh. Oh, goddamn. They took the goddamn back seats, got fucking holders everywhere. <laughs> even got, even, yeah, like cup holders or beer holders or whatever. But they, they said cup, they, people think cup holders would be more appropriate because if you're driving. Because if you're drinking alcohol beverages when you get behind when you get behind the fucking wheel, you're breaking the law. Shit, goddamn trunk space. <laughs> Shit, I wonder what type of. I always wonder, could it, how much, how big of a deer do you think would fit in there? But actually, one, but actually not a live one. Nah, because that'd be too cruel. He's 
got a goddamn spare tire. And his fucking wheels are 18 inches. Oh, that's nice. They even put a fucking... They even provide... Even a rental agency provides a goddamn... Oh, snow ice scraper. <laughs> yeah, right, ours is bare anyway. Oh, yeah, a nice trunk entrapment release. And people say it's a midsize. Yeah, it's a V6. So it's probably the 3.6 that GM offers. Yeah, they managed to get a good goddamn rate. When they offer a goddamn uh, FUD discount. If it was me, I'd rather to spend no. Because if, if, if I was ever in a situation where. If it was up to me renting a vehicle, I'd rather to spend two, three thousand dollars. I'd rather to spend maybe two, three thousand dollars and just buy some shit box from a used car dealership. And all that shit looks bigger. How good the back seats are. Like the, uh. Like how the, uh. Push button, everything here. Why well, I just put the goddamn, why well, I just hook the goddamn keys on the same, why well, I hook them together? It's so stupid. Your replacement cost. Talk about all the configuration, that motherfucker. There's a 2018. Goddamn rental agency. Huh. Yeah, with rentals. But only advantage with rental cars, you could do it. You could practically, yeah, the way they do it, like the way they treat rentals. Like they'll trash them, run the shit out of them, <laughs> redline the motherfuckers, do whatever. I wonder why why rental car agencies don't run out to people under 25 years of age. Well, that's pretty much it for the video there. Nice little tour of the vehicle.